Hi, my name's Julie Ritchie, and this is Tommy. Hi, how are you? The reason we're here today is to talk to you about the gift of life, donating blood. When Tommy was three years old, he was diagnosed with leukemia. He had been sick for quite a few months, and my husband and I could not find out what was wrong with him. And then one morning, he woke up incredibly sick. My husband took him to the pediatrician, where we were then advised to take him to DuPont Hospital. He got there around 11 o'clock in the morning, and at 10.30 that evening, the hematology oncology doctor came into our room and told us that Tommy had leukemia. He was incredibly sick at this time. The plans for the following day were for Tommy to receive a central line where they could draw his labs from easily and give him chemotherapy. They were to do a spinal tap, a bone marrow aspiration, and give him his first dose of chemotherapy. However, before any of these could happen, he had to have a blood transfusion. He was so sick that he could not go into surgery without the transfusion. Of course, my husband and I agreed to the transfusion. It happened that evening, and the following Monday, all four of those procedures took place. A three-year-old boy diagnosed with leukemia typically goes through three years of chemotherapy treatment. During the first nine months, it's incredibly intense. By intense, I mean there were dates where we had to take Tommy to the hospital every 10 days for chemotherapy treatment. At one point during those nine months, he had gotten really sick, and my husband and I were really scared that he had relapsed. And during the first nine months, if a leukemia patient relapses, it's not a very good thing. We took him to the hospital, they drew labs, and luckily we found out all he needed was a blood transfusion. Over three hours, he had his transfusion, and we took Tommy home that day, and he felt much better. Blood transfusions save lives, and in order to have blood transfusions, the American Red Cross needs people to donate. People like you need to donate in order to save lives. So please, at the next blood drive, come out and support the Red Cross and donate your blood, and you can save lives just like Tommy had his life saved. Is there anything else you'd like to add, Tommy? Yes. Please donate blood. It can save lives. Thank you.